Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Hunt Day Dog Call, the show that doesn't talk about the Georgia Bulldogs, but the Springdale Bulldogs. On today's show, our special guest is not related to Kirby Smart, so please welcome in Coach Beeler. Welcome in, Coach Beeler. Thank you for having me. Thank you. The pleasure is all mine. So, let's, without further, without no interruption, let's get on with it. First question, how does it feel to be back to back state champions. Uh, well, it feels good. Um, you know, to finish the year out with a win, you know, and not have that heartbreak at the end of the year is awesome. And to to do that twice in a row, that's that's pretty great. But, you know, I think just in general, um, everybody can relate to the feeling of, you know, putting in hard work and then seeing your hard work pay off. So whenever that happens, I I think that that's a really good feeling. And I can relate to that too. So. Next one up is how is your team doing this season? Um, so far, we're, you know, we're having mixed results. We've tied a game. We lost a game to a really good team in Broken Arrow that's uh, it's probably going to have a great season. And then we we kind of uh, got some things corrected and won a, won a good game against a good opponent in Norman North. So. Um, so far, you know, we're, we're still kind of in a learning phase of the season. We're trying to get better, um, but, you know, that's, that's what the coaches are there for and, and the players, I think, are committed to it. So I expect to see some good things. And let me tell you some good advice. You'll get over that hurdle once you accomplish it. All right. Next question. What is your favorite thing about coaching at Springdale? Uh, well, probably just working with the kids. Um, you know, you get to you get to help out uh, people who are becoming adults and, and uh, kind of help them through that path. You know, whether whether they plan on playing at the next level or they just, you know, are going to become good citizens, good, uh, you know, family members, good fathers, things like that. So that's the most rewarding part of the job. Uh, it's fun to go to practice and to be around soccer. Um, so. You know, that's another great part of uh, the job as well because you get to do something that you like to do. Yeah, that's what I like to do. That's what I like about my jobs too. And the final question, what do you say to encourage your players? Um, it's not any one thing in particular. Um, it's kind of whatever the, you know, the moment calls for, but really, you know, it's just about, uh, trying to inspire them to be the best version of themselves. I think, I think if, uh, you know, they can play up to their potential, if they can, uh, perform to what they're capable of, then that's going to give us the best chance to be successful. So that's really what most of my, uh, you know, discussions with them are about. And you know what they say when, when you can't come up with a thing, just play it by ear. Yeah, yeah. And that is going to wrap things up for the sixth episode of the Hump Day Dog Call. If you like today's show, join us on March 30th for our next episode where I'll be interviewing Coach Josh Rivers. But until then, have a terrific spring break. And remember, every day is a good day to be a Springdale Bulldog. <laughs>